Hello, so here I am back again. I'm just going to do another quick tutorial for you and this one is going to be on ruffled ribbon. So you know that I do a lot of cards with ruffled ribbon on them because I love the, the sheer ribbons but I love them to have a lot of depth and texture to them. So basically what I do is start with either the card or the panel that I'm going to put the ribbon onto and I use the Ranger Wonder Tape or Ink ink Essentials. I love it. It um, will grip like crazy, won't let go and your ribbon will stay on there even after the person receives your card or years down the track it will still be there. Okay, so basically what I do is put a piece of the Wonder Tape from top to bottom where I'm going to put it just bend it over and start off with one end open. I attach my ribbon. It doesn't have to be straight. It really doesn't matter. right? I don't take it all the way, the backing all the way off the tape to start with. Otherwise, you'll have the item sticking to your table or even your craft sheet and you'll end up having problems getting it off there. So basically, I'm just a little bit short with that V on there. Oh, see what I mean? But it really is super tacky and it's a wonderful tape. And basically I just go a little bit sideways, sideways again, and it just needs to pick up just a little bit. Just needs to stick on just a little tiny bit. It doesn't have to stick all the way down. Right, so that you get a nice little zigzag or a gathering. You know, this is my favourite way of doing it. Little pleats or whatever like this. I just love it. And all you do is just down and back all the way, or across and back all the way to the bottom of the sheet. And your top will never look the same as the bottom when you go around the back of your piece and it really doesn't matter. Tear it off, pop it down, cut it off and there you are. You're ready to attach this piece to your base card. Right, and I always have that I would actually put it like so on another panel and that would go on to my base card like so and I'd probably attach a couple of nice little bows to it with a hot glue gun. Okay, so I'll just do another one for you quickly so that um, you can see a different I just knocked over my cutter there, it really doesn't matter. Oh, looks like I was going to do something different on there, never mind. Oops. Okay. This one's just a, a full gather one, that's all, it'll be all the way down and again it doesn't have to be straight and perfect, you can do it as close together or as far apart as you like, but I just love the different effects that it gives and I mean you know that I like things that are textured, lots of layers. lots of different types of material so that you get lots of different aspects to things. Okay. See, and it doesn't have to be as neat as a pin or anything else. It can be as you want it to be. So there's two of them just like that as quick as you like. So Thank you very much for watching.
Bye.